how do you come out from your broke state if you are there struggling with money or if you have been broke for a long time and you're wondering how do i really come out of being from being broke there are some steps that people have been talking about or people have been implementing and i myself have been implementing so that i can come out from my broke state and i hope this these steps will actually help you also to come out from your broke state one of the ways that you can actually uh, come out from your broke state number one is accept but don't appreciate when you're talking about accept you know many people accept that yes i don't have money but they re- they're really not doing anything about it so one of the things that you have really to accept that you are broke and don't be in denial if you're broke you're broke don't be in denial but what after you have accepted yourself do not, do not just stay there do something about it and what do we mean by do something about it maybe look for a job opportunities maybe try to get advice on how to really start a business you know just don't stay there if just accept that you're broke but do not appreciate do not always say ah me i'm i'm always broke uh, that is my life I'm just conform to this do not appreciate then number two, one of the other steps that you should do to come out from your broke state number two is look around for any opportunity that is any job that is arising if someone offers, offers you a job of cleaning just take it if of, someone offers you a job of washing this dishes if someone offers you a job of washing dishes just do it do not be choosy on the type of job that you're doing because this is the same same job that will transform you and move you to the next level that you can once you start getting this money yes the no matter how much small it is this money is the one that will start or will help you to become stable and then that is where you can start now looking for other bigger jobs or other bigger opportunities so just start small do not do not start uh being proud and saying that oh i can't do such kind of a job and this applies also to ladies if you are a lady and someone offers you a job of cleaning clothes do not be do not say that oh it's going to ruin my nails no just do the job this is the job that will give you stability this is something that will push you to the next level then number three the next step you're supposed to do after you have uh, looked for an opportunity of maybe started a small job a side hustle maybe you're selling tea you're you're selling mandazis the next thing you're supposed to do is move out of your comfort zone and what do we mean by move out of your comfort zone this is where now we advise people to go and get skills get skills in a particular job and you find that these skills you can actually start by taking online course we have platforms that are offering free courses and they are sometimes they even online do these courses make sure that you're becoming good at a particular item and this, this is the item or the job or the, these skills that you will gain are the ones that will get, land you a job. So, as you are hustling, as you are doing your side gig, maybe, maybe let's say we have said that you can be selling tea. If, as you are selling tea, make sure in the evening you are just buying data and you are reading online. You are taking a course online, getting skills in a specific area. And you are constantly trying to learn more about these skills. So that, because this is the same, same skill that will land you a job. Then number four is exercise the skill you have learned and monetize it. monetize it. Once you have already started doing the side hustle, you have gone for online classes, or maybe you have talked to someone who can be, maybe in the evening, you can be volunteering at a place and getting skills. Maybe let's say in hairdressing, you have volunteered in a salon and you're getting the skills of braiding or maybe doing makeup. Now these skills, start exercising them and then you start monetizing them. And we have talked about even if it's makeup, you have you are, you went and did an online course on makeup or maybe on masonry, go and volunteer at a place, and then start taking or recording videos of you doing that work, and posting them. And that is where you once you start post, posting them, people in TikTok, people in LinkedIn, people in YouTube, Instagram, they will start noticing your work, and that is where you start getting your clients. So those are the five state steps of coming out from your broke state. We have said number one is accept but not appreciate. Number two, look around for any opportunity. Number three, move out of your comfort zone and get skills. Then number four is exercise the skills you have learned and then monetize it. I hope you have I hope you have learned a thing or two. If you have learned something, leave it in the comment section and I'll be sure to read it out. Make sure at the end of this video you like, comment, subscribe, share. 
hit on the notification button so that every time I upload a new video, you can always be notified. If you're interested in learning or getting skills, we have said that you should come out of your comfort zone. If you're interested in learning skills, you can actually enroll for online courses at Finstock University College. Visit their website at www.finstockuniversity.com or call them at 0703-313-722 or send them an email at info at Until next time, goodbye.